there's been a lot of buzz about what car Toyota would unveil as their concept. Now this is the new FT1 and we're going to show you why this car has given Toyota an interesting facelift. Toyota unveiled the FT1 concept at the International Auto Show in Detroit. The room buzz at their new futuristic sports car shared the essence of the legendary Supra. It boasted all the proportions of a sports car, with a front engine, rear wheel drive and a classic long hood. This sports car seems destined to hit the roads in the future, and if it does, it could radically shift Toyota's image. Okay, there has been a lot of buzz about Toyota's new concept. You guys were very tight-lipped. It was really hard to get any details before it was unveiled just now as the FT1. But how does it capture the spirit of the Supra? Well, I don't know if it captures necessarily the spirit of the Supra. I mean, a lot of people have speculated the Supra, but really this car draws heavily on our sports car lineage that goes all the way back to the 60s and 2000 GT and Celica and Supra. This is the embodiment of the ultimate Toyota sports car expression. That's what FT1 is. Future Toyota, the number one for ultimate. So you weren't at all inspired by the Supra with this model? We were inspired by Supra, Celica, 2000 GT, a few models. So, you know, in much the same way that an apple pie isn't just apples, it's crust, it's sugar, it's a few things that make up the ingredients. Supra could have been an ingredient in the influence of this product, but not solely. And what does this concept say about Toyota's future? This concept makes a statement about Toyota's future design direction in the sense that this, this is part of uh, Akio Toyota's mission to, to inject more passion and excitement into our exterior design. This is a, a, a purely passionate, purely emotional sports car concept, which is one of the better places to make those kind of expressions. So hopefully uh, consumers will interpret this as a place that we're going and uh, it will feature cues and some ideology and design that we'll see on future products. It does look really fast and really fun, so is there any chance it would be on the roads one day or is what would have to change for it to change from a concept to be on the roads? Well, once again, this is very much a, a, a design study. Quite a bit would have to change, I mean, to actually federalize this sort of thing and putting it into our real world. Uh, I mean, you know, uh, but uh, certainly a lot of the, the look of it, uh, if it were to be a production version, you could expect to see some of it. Uh, I don't know if we're here to speculate on what the production possibilities are. I know that's extremely tantalizing, but for the moment it needs to exist strictly in a design space and as a symbol for what it means to Toyota as a brand as far as where we're going from a design direction.